Hi. Hey guys. Hello, welcome back. Or welcome. For the first time. This is our first official video in our new place. That's right. Last one was a moving vlog. But now this is our first sit down That's right, video. we're sitting on our couch. Our new couch in we our have... new apartment with our new windows. <laughs> well, okay then. I asked a few days ago on Instagram for questions for a Q and A. It's a lot of random questions, some questions from before, but nothing like super long. We're just gonna go through some of the questions that yep. you guys had. Starting now, I have to get the questions. Question number one, basic. Hey, hey, where are you guys from? Go ahead. Ooh, that's a tough one. We're both from Southern California, mm -hmm. specifically Orange County. Born and raised. Born and raised. Um, well. well I grew up in Riverside, yeah. in Corona, for like 10 years. And then my family moved to Orange, went to school out there, high school. We met out there, mm -hmm. and um, yeah. I was born in Whittier, um, and then just kind of bounced around until uh, we moved to Placentia and when I was like mm, six, I think. Mm -hmm. And then ever since then, Orange County, and then we got married, moved to LA. But yeah, so now we're back. <laughs> we're back. SoCal, born and raised. Yeah. East Peace. Are you going to have any more children? Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes, that is yeah, the plan. Yeah, probably like six or seven. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> maybe like three. Total. Like three? Three total. Three more? No, three total. <laughs> yeah, probably like three kids. While pregnancy wasn't terrible for me, it wasn't... Not that pregnancy determines like how many children you have, but I just... <laughs> physically, I do not want to go through that more than... I want <laughs> more than I don't think God is going to have us have more than two more children. Oh, he said, "Be fruitful and multiply," <laughs> so we can multiply. <laughs> That's true, <laughs> but I want to be done realistically having kids by thirty-five. Yeah, logistically, thirty-five is creeping. <laughs> well, Zachariah's almost two years old now. He's not even almost a year. He's almost a year and a half. He's we, not almost. We two. need to get on the train and have another one. <laughs> yeah, but we do want more kids. Yes, we do want more kids. Absolutely. Hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. We're a little more settled now. Now it's more of like a... Yeah. It's it's more of... I'm not... I'm open to the conversation. Mm -hmm. Our stuff is out of storage. That's a long-winded way to say, yes, more children. Bang. Bang? <laughs> Maybe not bang, but, you know, boom. <laughs> Yay. Boom. Hello. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> if the lighting changes, it's because it's been raining, which is weird in Southern California. Um, but it's kind of like the clouds are going, woo. Woo. Anyway. All, All right, right, next question. This is kind of a random one. See, there go the clouds. Look at the clouds. <laughs> Favorite comic book superhero? Uh, growing up, it was between Batman and Superman, like most kids. I think Superman. Because he's, he's the Man of Steel. He can okay. fly. Um, he's an alien. He is? Yeah, he's from a different planet. Oh, I don't know comic books clearly. He's from the planet Krypton, okay? I see. He gets his power from our yellow sun. So kryptonite, is that, his, that, is that the whole thing? That's a weakness. It's is kryptonite like a real thing, like in real life? No. No. Oh. No. The planet is called Krypton, so. I see. Yeah, very fake. <laughs> I don't know. It's like Wakanda. Also fake. A lot of people got that wrong. People didn't know, I guess, geography. But yeah, I think Superman. Favorite comic book superhero? I don't know, Spider-Man? That's a good, I mean... I didn't really read. <laughs> was that a child or tires? <laughs> tires. <laughs> I didn't really read comic books. Yeah. Um, I didn't either. I watched the cartoons, so... Yeah, so... Spider-Man was up Spider there, Spider-Man seems cool. He gets to wear a cool suit and fly, but not fly. Well, he swings. Yeah, he's but he's got like... Slinger. Webs? <laughs> webs. <laughs> <laughs> but I want to do that. <laughs> And shoot people with my webs. That's not how he does it. Yeah, it is. Like this. Well, I, my fingers can't do that. <laughs> you got it. They can't do that. <laughs> but this is look. This is literally how. Messed I up can't. The Get some independence. It hurts down here. <laughs> it hurts the tendons. Oh. <laughs> anyway, okay. Spider Man. I like Spider Man. That's a good. I like when he wears the black suit. That's when he's evil. Oh. <laughs> That's when the symbiote gets on him, like Venom. Anyways, let's move on. What a nerd I am. 
Oh, jeez. You are a nerd. You know, I, I, I cared so much about this. <laughs> what is your favorite Bible verse? Ooh. Mark 10, 9. I just had to look up the number. I knew the verse, but what God has brought together, let no man separate. We used to have keychains that said it. I don't know where they are. That was like... They got separated. <laughs> they got separated. <laughs> Both of them, because neither one of us have one. I think it's in one of my boxes somewhere. I don't think I have it anywhere, Damn. but I think I got it for like an anniversary or just like a just because Something like that. I, I remember it, yeah. But it was like year three. Yeah. And we're like, what, year 11? 12? No. 12? 11. 11. 11. <laughs> 11. Yeah, year, year 11. 2009, year 11. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Your turn. Uh, I don't know that I have a Ian favorite. Ian doesn't have favorite anything, so... I really like uh, Genesis 1-1. One, one. <laughs> no lie, though, my favorite books are Genesis and Revelation. Okay. I, I don't know. I'm just... The cool thing about the Bible is that it always speaks. So, like, I feel like my favorites change, you know? Like, yeah. depending on what... I don't know, what I'm reading at that time. But, but Philippians 4.13 is solid. I yeah, can do all things in Christ who strengthens me. That is a good one. Ian doesn't really have favorites. Everything is his favorite. The Bible is his favorite. Jesus is his, Jesus, Jesus is his favorite. So yeah, that's the I, best I think, that you're going to get from him. I think it's just whatever whatever's applicable in the moment. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. It is all good. So I don't really have a... God is good all the time. And all the time. God is good. All right, next question. How did you and Ian meet? We're gonna do a whole video on like how we met, but long story cut very short, Olive Garden. Stay tuned to find out what that means. 1389, represent. OG. <laughs> That's a telescope. That's not OG. <laughs> OG. <laughs> oh, this isn't a fun one. What's your favorite kind of ice cream? Again, you're not gonna get Right now? Vanilla. Right, not vanilla. Oh. Right now I'm feeling coffee ice cream. Oh, that is a good one. Coffee's my favorite ice cream right now. Mm. I will say that Cherry Garcia by Ben & Jerry's is probably my favorite. Okay. Or Pina Colada. But I think Cherry Garcia. I, I could, like, like that. eat that at any point. Yummy. Now I want some ice cream. Let's go get some. I know. See you guys. <laughs> I will say... <laughs> oh, excuse me. I, I do... <laughs> I would rather eat ice cream when it's cold than when it's, Me too. When it's hot. It's, it's, the Bailey's and coffee ice cream from... That's pretty good. From haagen -Dazs. You have to get the two together because the Bailey's <clears> is Irish cream and then you get the coffee and it's just... That sounds good. Today's a good day for it because it's raining and cold. Ice cream. I like cold we, day ice cream. Oh, that makes me go, think back to... <laughs> <laughs> that makes me think back to when we first started dating. We would go to downtown Disney and we'd get the coffee yeah. and Bailey's ice cream. Yeah, yeah. Throwback. Maybe that's why it's my favorite. Oh, that was good. That was good. It was a good memory. When it was cold in winter. I mean, I guess I could answer this. Have you always been into white guys? Yes. <laughs> I mean, is there a deeper meaning <laughs> behind that, or like? I mean, I don't know. I grew up in Orange County and went to a predominantly white school and really liked the Backstreet Boys. <laughs> Not so much in sync, but how dare you say that? In sync all the way. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna play their Christmas album soon. <laughs> They do have good Christmas songs. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Orange County, that's, that's kind of what it is. <laughs> it is what it is. I mean, but you could grow up somewhere and not be like... But I mean, like, when you kind of, when you're surrounded by... <clears throat> you're kind of like a product of your surroundings, and that was yeah, my surroundings. Sort of, maybe, but not always. I mean, for reference, I went to a predominantly white school. I think there were four black people in my <laughs> entire high school. I'm dead serious. That's true. I guess you like what you like. You like what you like. I mean, I'm pretty spicy. You know what my last name not. is? Yes. Gonzalez. Oh, gosh. I'm Latino. Um, <laughs> how did you know your husband was the one? I guess these are questions for me. Well. Well, I guess I'll just sit here. <laughs> I'm definitely a hopeless romantic. I definitely believe in love at first sight. And I don't know. I guess I fell in love at first sight. I know when he walked through those doors, like the first day, I just knew, like, it doesn't matter if we're together, like I was going to love you. I would prefer to have been in love with you, mm -hmm. which is what I got, but I knew that I loved him as soon as I saw him. Oh, so. that's sweet. And I did what I had to do to secure the bag. What was that? Just kidding. It's one of those things where people say, oh, when you know, you know, and I just knew, but you don't know until you know, you know, you know? I know. Does that make sense? I think so. The same with like a wedding dress, not on the same scale, but <laughs> <laughs> a 
Like I didn't, I knew, I thought I knew what I wanted in my dress. And then I tried on my actual dress and it's like, oh yeah, they're right. When you know, yeah. you know. And here we are, 11 years later. <laughs> Smell my feet? Yeah. Hablas espanol? Yes, I do speak Spanish. I speak it better than I understand say it. Say something. I don't want to. Go ahead, say something. It you makes say, me nervous. No, you said you speak, so let's hear it. It makes me nervous. Let's hear it. I want to hear something. Hola. That's not how you speak it. No, I can't do it. Speak it like on I can't our honeymoon. Do it. Oh well, I don't want to. We had a we had a like a taxi driver. He only spoke Spanish, and Lisa mm -hmm. was they were just chopping it up. Yeah. And I was just sitting there. <laughs> he was giving us like pointers and advice. And he was giving you pointers and advice. He was giving I was us. Like, I was the <laughs> communicator. I was like, sure, sure, yeah, yeah. Anyway, my Spanish has gotten worse over the years since leaving a restaurant, but <laughs> I can speak Spanish. I'll be right back. Okay. Hey guys, it's just me now. I want to take this opportunity to talk about myself. <laughs> well, your mom and sisters make an appearance. Challenges with them would be entertaining, haha. -ha. I don't know. It's possible, but we'll see. They don't live with us. <laughs> mm -mm. So, if they're around, potentially, but I don't think like, unless our families are wanting to be in it wanting to be in videos yeah. we're not gonna like put that on them like we're right. not really gonna vlog when we're around family just because we want to hang out with them um we don't want them to not everybody's like, comfortable in front of the yeah. camera i'm not always comfortable in front of the camera but i have to be in the good well thanks because i'm pretty private by nature but yes <laughs> i'm not um but no. we want to respect <laughs> We want to respect our families and you know, we don't want them to always have to feel like they're on if we're around If that makes sense yeah. like oh like Ian and Lisa are gonna ring their camera We got to like be on not that they would have that attitude, but you might you know You, never know. you don't want to be surprised like with a camera in your face. That's true. If you're just expecting to like hang out. <laughs> yeah, so we'll see maybe uh, Give us a home tour soon. We will <clears throat> soon. We How will you and me oh, We could do two more. What's your favorite hairstyle you've ever had? Uh, my hair is changing, so I, I used to have like more straight hair, and so then I'd do like the Liberty Spikes. You did Liberty there. Spikes? Oh yeah, eighth grade. Aww. Eighth grade, everybody had those. I would have been into you in eighth grade. I know, and then I. Oh, had, you know. Oh yeah, hundred percent. All the girls were. So <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, I'm He's kidding. not lying. I'm kidding. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm not arrogant like that. <laughs> yeah, I had bleached hair, spiked hair. Um, I had shaggy hair, Zac mm -hmm. Efron style, for a while there. Mm -hmm. What's my favorite? Again, Ian doesn't have favorites. I mean, my favorite is whatever looks good in the moment. Right now, my hair's kind of curly and being weird, so it's it's easy to just cut the sides short, give it a little trim, trim, trim up top, and kind of let it just do its thing. So, I think I liked your wedding hair. Oh, that was the gentleman's cut. Very clean, nice fade. A little part of it. Look at those palm trees. <laughs> I like. Your wedding hair, and I liked probably like not the first time I bleached it, but the second time I bleached it. Yeah, yeah, when it was like, like that really period, white. Yeah, yeah, that yeah. was really good. When we went to the church Coachella. Coachella thing, yeah. Thing. But even like that first, not the very first time, because I needed to bleach it one more time. Sorry, That's it's right. talking hair. Um, but like that period of time. Yeah. It was good. It was a good period for hair. As far as me, I prefer like long extensions, long mermaid hair. Um, I don't have any in right now because we don't really go anywhere and I just feel like it's a waste of money to be chilling in the house. Although for recording videos, it might be different, but when it was just me hanging out 24 seven in the house, it's kind of like, well, no one sees me. I don't even see me. I'm not even putting on like makeup. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> or, but I also like braids. I like braids on you. Braids. Very nice. I feel like I'm a natural bottle redhead. What? What does that like mean? A, like a bottle blonde, but I feel like on oh, the inside... A... Yeah, bottle blonde's a term. Oh. Like you were a bottle blonde. Got it. I just feel like when I have red hair, I feel like the most like me. I'm a big fan of doing hair at home because if I don't like it, then I only spent like $7. And I've never really destroyed my hair, so... Sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was I holding in that yawn for like <laughs> five minutes. Oh, yeah. Haven't destroyed his hair, haven't destroyed my hair. I mean, obviously, when you process your hair, it gets weaker. <laughs> the wind, wind is, is crazy. crazy. <laughs> but yeah, braids I can't do. I cannot braid my own hair. Mm. I don't have the patience. I don't want to braid my hair for six hours. I just don't. And I don't really want to learn. Well, and your wedding hair was nice, too. A bun? It was you a requested bun. it. It was like a ballerina bun. Yeah. Because I like to see her neck. She has very elegant lines. <laughs> From my ballerina days. I didn't force her, by the way. He I didn't. just asked if she would 
consider it. You you wanted me to have my hair pulled back away from my face. Yeah. Which was actually easy for me because then I didn't have to worry about frizz or like my curls falling or really anything that could happen. If it was windy, you don't want like, you know? I know. <laughs> I know. But it, I would have definitely sweat out like a press. Oh yeah, it was so hot. <laughs> it was 105. So hair up in a ballerina bun worked out. Do you guys ever argue? <laughs> no way! We, we never argue. <laughs> oh my gosh, arguing? We didn't argue yesterday. <laughs> Couples who argue? To, no. Yeah, we argue all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't say, well, no, we're well, we don't, if we are. We don't, we don't fight very often. And when we do fight, we don't fight dirty or like call each other names. Yeah. Yes, we don't, as in no. Yeah, yeah, we don't raise our voice. It gets a little loud sometimes, but not yelling. Yeah. Nobody ever yells. If we yell... I don't yell at you. I mean, it's happened once, maybe twice, but twice in 11 years, but we don't- But we do argue, yeah. We do argue, yes. It could be something little, usually, and usually little arguments are the ones that turn into large arguments. But I feel like over the years, we've gotten a lot better. Way better. I think you were kind of more like sweeping under the rug. Yeah. Or just like, act like it didn't happen, and then just like come up and be like, haha, and then everything's good, but yeah. it's not good. But also, I was like, hey, we're allowed to argue and still come to a resolution. It's yeah. not like the end of the world. Yeah. If we argue or if I think something different than you or you think something different than me, yeah. everything's gonna be fine. We can, you know. And also just like learning each other's communication styles. Like, yeah. I very much need, I needed a minute, and I still need a minute, and he, Usually, I feel like this is like flip-flop, but usually like the woman wants to talk about things right away. He wanted to resolve things right away. And... Yeah, why let it fester? <laughs> I'm like, let's just talk about it. Let's, it's very simple. I feel like a lot of what, what, why our like arguments would blow up in the past were because he wanted to solve it and resolve it right away. And I'm like, I need a minute to just go from here to here. And I felt like I wasn't getting that minute. It's like, if you want me to apologize while I'm here, it's not going to come out the way you want. And I was just like, be mature and apologize. No. <laughs> and I'm like, I don't mean it right now, so yeah. I can either say it and not mean it, or you can give me a minute to calm down from a 10, and then, yeah. you know. So. But arguments, they happen. They happen. I don't, I, I hate, I don't ever want to be that person that like, gives advice. But anyways, I'm going to do it right now. Something that helps me is if we like go away mm -hmm. and kind of just like cool off, I always pray, Lord, if, if I'm wrong speak to me because i don't want to be wrong even though yeah. even though sometimes i'm like a hundred percent i'm right i know i'm right i'm justified and then sometimes the lord's like are you and i was like am i <laughs> <laughs> so i think it's important to just be humble too yeah. and to, to apologize sometimes it's not what you say it's how you say it and all sorts of stuff like and that and the timing so, and timing so just be humble yeah with each other and you'll resolve it it'll be very easy but yes, we do argue. It's normal. I don't feel like we, we definitely don't argue as much as we used to, um, but you know. Stuff happens. Stuff happens. Also, the big C is your best friend. What's the big C? Compromise. Oh, I thought you were talking about Christ. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> Cause I was like, big capital C, compromise, yeah, yeah. The, the two C's. Also, I feel like people think like compromise is like, everything I like, everything I am yeah. is gone. That's not true. I mean, God made you the way he made you, yeah. you still, but you just don't have to live for yourself all the time. I feel like that was probably my biggest issue, like, early on. Compromise? The big C? <laughs> not Christ, but compromise. Mm -hmm. um, I'm very much a, uh, this is like a full-on long tangent, but I feel like yeah. I'm very much an individual, and I felt like I had to, like, assert that, like, I don't need you. Not, I don't need you, but I yeah, was yeah. very much like, I don't need you, I'm my own person. Mm -hmm. Like, I got this figured out. No 22 year old has it figured <laughs> out. <laughs> Newsflash. Um, so, yeah. I definitely had a lot of growing up to do. I, we both well, did. Everybody but does. Communication. There's, I guess, a lot of C's. A lot of C's. Christ, Christ communication, communication, compromise. compromise. Um, Should get that on a shirt. <laughs> we have a request to do water and mouth laughing challenge. For my good friend Cindy. Done. But we're gonna do it outside. <laughs> yeah. Or in the <laughs> spit kitchen. On, spit water on the carpet. I feel like we'll do probably a good amount of challenges. Yeah. Now that like we're in our own space and not that we couldn't do it before, but I don't I wouldn't want to mess up like somebody else's space. Yeah, true. And Carpet we came to the conclusion that uh, we're 
with a toddler, we're probably not going to get any of our deposit back, so. <laughs> it would be a miracle. <laughs> it would be a miracle. It would be a miracle. <laughs> Well, that is our Q&A. Thank you everybody for the questions. Very random, sporadic all over the we place. We spent a lot but... of time on arguments. But you know, people like to hope... watch advice. I uh, like to watch advice. Yeah, I hope it was, hope there was something there to take away. If not, I hope you enjoyed watching us talk about arguments. <laughs> <laughs> if you have any more questions for like a future Q&A, drop them in the comment section. That's right, if you have any suggestions for other videos you want us to do, we'll do them. Well, within reason. Within reason. And uh, let's go get some Cherry Garcia. I thought we were going to get Bailey's and coffee. Ice cream, not the actual. Are we arguing right now? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. See ya. Wait, like, comment, oh. subscribe. Share it. Share it. Tell your friends. That's right. And we'll see you in the next one. That's right. Bye. <laughs>